not stream, record. Hey gang, what's up? Uh, I just want to give a video update for this week, which would be June 12th, 2023. Um, the conference was fine last week. It was The conference was fine. The hotel was a nightmare. The hotel was an absolute nightmare. We're still dealing with issues of overcharging, and it was just done poorly in my opinion. But anyway, conference was great. Learned some new technologies. I work in the healthcare industry and IT, and so... Uh, we use a product called Inner Systems uh, for our integration engines, and so it was for Inner Systems, obviously. And so, <clears throat> learned some new techniques that uh, new products that they're using. Some of half of it kind of felt like a sales pitch uh, for their stuff, like cloud hosting and solutions, and the other half was. Uh, the other a quarter of it wasn't anything I was really interested in because it had to do with supply chain and I work for a hospital so we don't do supply chain really we do medical supplies uh, so they're two different things we don't worry about the supply chain that from the aspect of rakes and tractors and diapers and mustard and ketchup and food and things we're talking about bone screws and chest saws and other things. <laughs> so, uh, col columnar uh, tables was a really fascinating. Uh, you guys may or may not care about this. Um, columnar tables was fascinating. How they can, uh, you know, how in a database, you talk, a table usually has the data stretched out through a row. <laughs> And that one row would capture all the data for a specific product. Uh, you know, take a Band-Aid. Uh, it'll one. You know, you'll have rows for pricing, uh, size, um, all kinds of aspects of the bandages, whatever the case, right? The manufacturer, the stuff like that. So, um, when you do a SQL query, sometimes it could take a long time to go through sixty thousand database table rows to get the data that you want just because it's spread out all over the place and so columnar uh, tables would use a column to capture the data for something you'd want to do uh, massive amounts of querying for such as prices or whatever the case um, and so it was really fascinating how they can do columnar tables to get query results, SQL query results and uh, a fraction of the time that it takes a normal database. So that was pretty cool. Um, AI is everywhere. They're integrating AI for all that stuff. So anyway, it was a fun, it was a really good, um, I had an enjoyable time at the conference. I failed the certification because they just released a brand new version two days prior to the conference and intentionally made it ridiculously hard uh, like, so if you had a multiple choice, if you had a question that had five choices and you were to select two, you don't get a point for the one you got right. You either to all or nothing. And so that was something that we didn't really expect. So none of us, the four of us went and none of us passed any of our certifications. It was embarrassing <laughs> to say the least. Um, <clears throat> That being said, I did miss pretty much a, a whole week of gaming. I'm trying to do better about my coughing. Um, so what I did yesterday, I had some downtime. Uh, and so I went through and looked at all of my remaining recordings of No Man's Sky and put those into videos. They are just, I just raw, do, raw dumped them in there. Um, so I don't know what's in there exactly. I kind of skipped through and to see what was going on, but your guess is as good as mine. So for those of you who <laughs> have been enjoying the No Man's Sky play interceptor pl chill playthrough, uh, with me is, is there's at least four more videos coming. I think I have it up to 33 videos. So this week and some next week, but that being said expedition just came out and so i really want to play that but i want to record it um and 
show, share that experience with you to, for those of you unaware of how an expedition would work in No Man's Sky. This is, it'd be a great, um, maybe 10, 20 hour, uh, playthrough of that expedition. Uh, hopefully I can get it done sooner than that. The goal of an expedition is it's a special, well, we'll get into it later, but it's a special, um, event in No Man's Sky. And so you have to start a new save as an expedition it's a community expedition so multiplayer you're gonna run into people you're gonna share <clears throat> information you're gonna uh, potentially have experiences with other players so it's a, it's a lot of fun uh and the in the goal of the expedition is to complete all of the tasks that you have assigned in your quest book so to speak uh, before the time runs out. And I think it's a five week. Now we're down one week. I'm out. So we got four weeks left to finish this. Um, and me personally, I only ha really have this week and next week to get it done. Uh, cause we're going on vacation. Uh, the last week of July, I'll be out of town. So, so I'm hoping in a couple of days to record all that, go through the expedition, get the, get the rewards. And the great thing about our expedition is you earn, um, you earn items in the game and equipment and super cool things that you can't get in just a normal game. You have, can only get these rewards through, it could be a ship, it could be a backpack, it could be a mask, it could be build components for your stations, it could be all kinds of things. Um, creature eggs, that's all kinds of stuff. Um, and so if you don't get them in the expedition, you just don't get them. So it's a fun yet frustrating way to get people engaged because if you miss the expedition, you miss the stuff. So it's a little frustrating sometimes, but it's not too bad. So that's the that's the thing I'm going to be working on. I've been playing a lot of Valheim in my free time. Just kind of had the mo uh, been in the mood. I, I love Valheim's building. I love... Um, just the gathering of resources. I, I'm a, a timber. I love just going through a forest and clearing out trees. I don't know what it is. It's soothing. It's relaxing for me. I just love how it f they fall. I love how the sounds, I just love everything about it. So a lumberjack in Valheim for sure. I beat the first boss and the second boss so far. Just for funsies. I haven't been recording it. Just kind of for fun. Because I wanted to be low key, low stress. Just something to do. So I've been doing I've been doing that. But I've got a ton of games that I still want to get back to. I want to get back into Spaceborne 2. Um, because they had a big update. And I really want to play it. The problem is there's just not enough time to play all the games that you want. And for me specifically, I need two things to align. I need the time to play the game. And I need to have <clears throat> a desire to play that game. I can't, I'm this why I'm not a streamer uh, like Co Carnage or Tim Tatman, Dr. Disrespect, or whatever, or Nick Merckx, whoever you watch, because I can't just force myself to play a game to play a game. If I'm not in it mentally and emotionally, I just don't care about it at all. Like Factorio is my favorite game of all time. But I haven't played it eight months, six months, a year. I don't even know when the last time I was played it because it's just not, not in the mood. So if I had a YouTube channel or a Twitch channel that was just Factorio, I'd get burnt out and get so bored with it. I'd, I wouldn't. It wouldn't last long. So, so Valheim. We got uh, this week. We got what um, <clears throat> EA. Some new sports or not sports, but uh, new games stuff coming out. I have, I'm on TikTok. I've already seen um, the trailer for Fable, the new Fable with uh, Richard Aoadi, who's the <laughs> the giant uh, in that. I just love him. I think he's the greatest. Uh, one of my favorite, if not my favorite, comedian of all time. He's just hilarious. Um, so anyway, that's where I'm at. Um, no Man's Sky Interceptor this week. I was kind of skipped through. Like, I don't even know if I'm on my record. I need to go back on my computer and find all my recordings because at one point, I don't know if I, I don't know if I walked through my process of money making. I'll have to find out where those are. 
because I'm not sure exactly. I don't want to go back and spend eight hours watching my own videos that I've already played for eight hours to see what's in them. You know what I'm saying? Um, there's better use of my time, I think. There's there's better things to do. Anyway, that was a long ramble of information. So, hope everybody has a good week. Enjoying the games and the things that you like. <laughs>